As part of my efforts to manipulate you into being my soap making friend, I'm going to show you how I made this pan soap. And we start with a fragrance that smells of acceptance and a general love of the soul. Now that we've combined our fragrance and our oil base, we're going to add our lye solution. When you add a lye solution to an oil base in just the right ratio, you trigger a chemical process called what? <laughs> Did you sing it? Within which all of your lye and most of your oils turn into soap. Now, you know oil and water don't mix, so we use the immersion blender to agitate the lye solution and the oils together until they no longer separate. Now, in the soap making world, when you achieve that type of emulsification, we call it trace. Now that my soap batter is nice and emulsified, I'm going to pour it into a mold. Now, I'm starting with my uncolored soap batter because I felt like it and I'm grown. I have this vision for what I want the soap to look like and I'm not really following any rules. Next, I have some whimsy that's been predispersed in oil. Anything that is not required to make soap, I call whimsy, including the fragrance. Oh, and it's important to note, the more you agitate your soap batter, the thicker it gets. So I choose the hand stir instead of using the immersion blender. And that's because I want my whimsied soap batter to, um, mm, I want it to still be strongly demarcated from the uncolored soap batter, but I don't want it to be clumpy. I want it to blend just a little bit because I'm going to throw this whole loaf of soap into my oven that is warm, but turned off and force gel phase, which means that uncolored soap batter is going to become slightly translucent. And here, here's why I need grace because I made a mistake. I'm pouring whimsy dispersed oil on top of my soap to emboss it. Uh, mm, theoretically, the soap batter should absorb that and it'll look like it's engraved, but I poured too much oil. And you can see it pooling down there at the bottom. So there's too much oil for the soap to absorb, but that's okay. It's only a cosmetic issue. It will not affect the performance of this soap and she's still pretty. All right, I'll show you the cut tomorrow.